Yo, what up? It's Addison. Welcome to the most humble show. the most humble show how much you know about the bible but this time with more guests than the huge we got my buddy kwan here what's up kwan what's good how y'all doing we got my buddy pat what's good the young homie the little homie and then sleep hey what's up everybody you're tuned in welcome back for another episode pat we're gonna ask the questions to you this episode are you ready uh yeah Alright, I love your It's a lot of confidence. You're, I think it's the shirt. Tell <laughs> everyone about your shirt, off? and then it, they, they know where to get one now. Okay. Let them know. Yeah, um, if you tune into the show, you uh, can get free t-shirts and gift cards. Yeah, come on our show. Play How Much You Know About the Bible. Pat's gonna play. His opportunity for a free gift card or shirt is here and now. You just got to get five in a row right or eight out of ten. Slade's going to ask the questions because he's your big bro. Woo. I'm going to do go. the sound effects. Slade, explain the rules. All right, sounds good. Explain the All rules. All right, the rules. So if I remember correctly, you're going to answer ten out of ten questions, correct, you think? <laughs> how, how, how? What's your score, you think, out of ten? Six. Six. Nice. That's solid. Very, that's what I guess. That's honest. You, that's might honest. you might do it. That's good. That's good. All right. So how it works. You get one right. Yes. Boom. Air horn. Air horn. You get one wrong. Don't laugh at you. Shame. <laughs> All right. But. People are listening. But it is in your hands whether you get the air horn or we laugh. So let's get started without further ado. Patrick. Question one. Ah, question one. Let's go. How many commandments are there? Ten. Ten is correct. Very nice. Name three. Name three of the Ten Commandments. Uh, no adultery, no stealing, no murdering. I like it. All right. That's correct. Okay, okay. Keep the, going. Let's see how many he can do. How many for a bonus? A bonus. A bonus uh, point. Wait, it's just for this round. A bonus point. Name um, some more. that's three. No, God shall become before me or something like that. Uh, what else? That's the first commandment. You should have no other gods before me. Name another. Can you, you name can keep it up, dude. You can do this. You're doing really I good. I know it. Um, That's four. You named four. I know the other one. But I'm the Lord your God. You shall have no other strange gods before me. What's the second? Oh, I forget. Uh, mm. Sorry. So we got the. We got it right. Do you want to phone a friend? <laughs> Question number four. Question number... No, this is three. That was the bonus. This is question three, right? We're going to give him the bonus for the four, but you only got one more, right? So I think that's fair. Let's do it. We're just number All right. three. All right. Oh, that's too easy. Come on. Hey, hey you're hey, peeking. Really I see you look. peeking. Come on, come on. Cheat and Bible screen. trivia. This is the... This is the uh, <laughs> I'm just I have, I, have, I have a screen protector anyways. Sorry. Right. Privacy see. screen. Yeah. How many of each animal came onto the ark... And why? Wait, can you repeat the question again? Yeah. How many? So, how many of each animal came onto Noah's ark, and why? Yeah. Why? Why did that many? Why did that amount of animals come why to the ark? The number? I get it. I get the question. Makes sense. Um, one of every animal came on. One. Is that your final answer? Uh, Is one your final answer? And why? Yes. 
Well, then just explain why. I don't know why. Uh, I don't know why. It's all right. It's sometimes we... <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, it's two, and the oh. reason is two is so that they can re rebreed. Oh. Yeah. They can breed and they can get new. K-I-S-S-I-N-G. Yep. That's, you know it happens. All right. Question number four. Five. Five. Matt's not my. Trying to do air horns. You know what I mean? All right. <laughs> all right. All right. Reaction guy. Who were the first people? God created. Adam and Eve. Ooh, okay. that's a good and one. Bonus question: Who are their sons that they name in the Bible? Abel and uh. <clears throat> don't don't look at it. Don't pressure him. He knows it. Sorry, sorry. He's got it. There's two others. No by the way. It's no not pressure. just the other. Yeah, I know. Yeah, you got it. Um. Abel and Cain. Okay, and then there's another. Who's the good one? Cain killed Abel, and then God provided Abraham. Seth, but that's I like your I like your reach for it. Shout out to young kids reading the Bible. You're doing pretty good, dude. If we're counting on the board right now, I think you got three out of five. So you really got to nail these next five questions if you want to get the prize. Can't get these wrong. Quan, you're just the audience member right now, and you haven't provided a lot of reaction. I want you to give us a live reaction right in this next question. Can you do that? I'm actually very intrigued. Yes, I am. All right, thank you. Uh, we're going live to Quan after this question. <laughs> all right, all right. Who baptized Jesus? John the Baptist. Whoa! Whoa! And in what river? The Jordan River. Okay, okay, let's okay. go. Surprising. Incredible. Let's go. What is that? Is that that's six. So now you're at question seven. You're at four out of seven. Five out of seven. He's the, if we if he gets all yeah, the five, five next to let me Let's go. He's getting all right. Now how many people did Jesus baptize? What? It's, don't give an answer. So say it's a little stupid question if you don't want to question it. Maybe you know. Maybe I don't... You know the number. Um... Tell Slade off if you have to. Just tell him. <laughs> just tell him. Just Think about it. Think about the question. How many right, people did to, Jesus... I'll just... I'm and, sorry. It was a twi- yeah, It was a trick no, question. Do <laughs> it was a trick question. Don't that should not that count. That shouldn't count. <laughs> How many apostles did Jesus have? It's either 12, 13, or like 24. But if you can't choose three numbers because that's not how anything is, go with one number. One answer. There's one correct answer. It is? 14. No, 12. What? You added 14? 14. <laughs> you said 12, 13, and 24. Anyway, it was one of those, man. You were right. 12. It was 12. It was too right the first time. But then you added two things to it. You know, you know why? You know why you, you said so many other things? What did you say first? You said twelve. Yeah. From your heart, and you oh, said, no, 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 don't, don't speak from your heart. The heart is wicked above all things. Who can know it? What did it Quan? What was your reaction? You gotta believe, Peter Pan. Believe. Okay. All right. Moving forward. Question eight. Where did Jesus grow up? In Nazareth. Nice. That is nice. Where was he born? Um, Bethlehem. Very nice, wow. dude. You're reading your Bible. Wow. I love that. Yeah, love that. All right, question 10. Oh, we'll give him the air horn. Credit where it's due. <laughs> Final question. What language was the Bible originally written in? Uh... Think about it. Think about it. The entire, the entire Bible. No, I, I know. I just don't know how, how, how to like say it. Like how. Like, oh my. Give me another can question. Can I give you? Can I give you another question? Give me another question. No, no, no. Give no. me another question. No, Sorry. no, no, no. Well, if you don't, if we don't know, we don't no, want no, you to I, guess. No, I know, I know, I know. You know it. You know I think it. I know. All right. We want. Then, what is it? Like, the uh, Hebrew language. Aramaic is Aramaic. 
Hebrew. It's in Aramaic, but all right. Yeah, I knew it was in like Hebrew. Hebrew, all right. Aramaic. That's the Aramaic. Right, I'll take it. Give us a that fun counts. fact. That counts. Give us one fun fact for a redemption for your question you got wrong. Give us a fun fact about the Bible we don't know. Now's your opportunity. Uh, um, uh, no pressure, bro. It's not even pressure. No. Sheriff is a fact about the Bible. What do you know? You were just telling. Just tell us a fact. He you was, know a lot about the he Bible. Was, he you was telling me something about, about prophecy. Remember? The moon? Uh, in, the, in the last uh, days. In the last days. Um, in the last days. Uh, the moon. there will be, like, a lot of, uh, blood moons. Okay. I'll take it. Okay. That's a fact. It's been a lot of fun, guys. Thank you so much. Jobs to come. Jobs to, like, thank you for coming on the show, Pat. You did a great job. Thank you for having me. Yeah, man. We'll have you back soon. It's top dog. Here, you win this book. Read, read the book the title to people. Let them know what you want. Uh, yeah, so the title of this book is called God's Hall of Fame. Okay. And then what's it about in the back? It'll tell you. Welcome to God's Hall of Fame, where you'll all meet 25 of the greatest Christians of all time. From Augustine to Crosby, Elliot to Graham, Luther to Moody, and Ten Boom to Wesley. You'll find some of the most interesting, most powerful, most godly people to ever live and serve Christ on this earth. Alright. I think that's going to be a great read, dude. And it's, like, little. You know what I mean? Look at it. It's, like, about like 80 pages. That's digestible. I hope it's a blessing to you. Thanks for coming on. I'll see you soon. Hello, and thanks for tuning in to The Most Humble Show. This is Steve Furman with Allied Mortgage Group. I'm a senior loan officer, and I've been with Allied Mortgage for over 18 years. If you're looking for a lender with low closing costs, low interest rates, and exceptional service, look no further. 856-371-9336. Again, 856-371-9336. Just ask for Steve, and we will go above and beyond helping you get approved to purchase your new home. NMLS number 199530. Again, just ask for Steve. We're always here to help and looking forward to speaking to you soon.